Good morning out there, Lombard family. It is Friday, February 25th, and it's the day we call High Five Friday. Yeah, it's okay. You can give me a high five as well uh, because we are here. We have made it to the end of the week. Uh, so if you are someone like me that I'm struggling knowing, what can I celebrate? It was a rough week. Um, at times, you know, I feel like I wasn't even on my best game this week. And so I'm going to just celebrate today that I am here on a Friday. I am showing up and I am ready again to make some connections with students and do my best to accomplish new goals that I have uh, uh, established. Uh, so Lombard students and staff, Find something to celebrate today, and if you're like me, just celebrate that you are showing up, you are trying to do your best uh, during still a very difficult time. And my favorite month is coming soon, and it's March Madness, and I'm a basketball fan, so it's always been um, a fun month uh, in our home, um, and so I hope to bring some of that energy and enthusiasm and fun to our building. Again, it's about your mindset, because I'll tell you right now, I am exhausted, uh, but again, it is all, we can always make the best out of every situation. So students today, let's follow expectations. Let's get those hoods off, all of you. Let's commit to that hoods off so we can see those incredible, beautiful, handsome faces. Uh, let's keep our building safe by being able to see everybody. Okay, again, I don't have to remind you of masks because you get the choice there, uh, but I really want to raise the bar here, students. I want you to walk in the hallway. I don't wanna see students running today. Um, and again, leaders out there, let your leadership be contagious. I promise you students will start to recognize uh, that you are leaders and they will start to follow. Um, but again, I'm ready for us to just have an amazing Friday. So again, thank you to our students that want to be a part of a great school because we are Zephyrs. We're part of District 205 uh, and it's a, a sense of pride and it's a pride of wanting our building to be the best. And I told students that yesterday when we we're making some positive phone calls home, there's a long hallway in the office. If you haven't had an opportunity to come visit the office, and those students, when we were ringing the bell and making positive phone calls home, I told them, you need to be walking with your head held high uh, because you are doing great things at Lombard. I want to see some more greatness today, Zephyrs. Uh, it's a great feeling when you can accomplish goals and you are somebody who is, again, leaving a positive imprint uh, in our hallways, in the classrooms, in the cafeteria. Um, those lectures I heard yesterday, sixth grade, let's stop those lectures. Uh, let's let our deans get to have some fun uh, times with you uh, in our building. Uh, at this time, we do have some birthdays to celebrate. I know we have some weekend birthdays as well, so let's be ready to sing that happy birthday song. Happy birthday, happy, happy birthday. We celebrate your life today. We're glad that you were born today. Well, we don't need today, you know what we mean, eh? Happy birthday, happy, happy birthday. We celebrate your life today. We're glad that you were born today. Well, we don't need today, you know what we mean, eh? Happy birthday, happy, happy birthday. We hope you have a very happy birthday. Now let's see what's on the lunch menu for today. Lunch, lunch, it's time for lunch. Lunch, it's time to munch, crunch, eat a bunch. It's time for lunch, not brunch. I'm starving. Lunch, lunch. On the lunch menu for today, it is pizza fiestata, corn salad, baby carrots, a banana, apple crisp, and a chocolate chip cookie, and your choice of white or chocolate milk. On the lunch menu for Monday, it's chicken and waffles, blueberries, Brussels sprouts, and yogurt, and your choice of white or chocolate milk. Starting next week, we'll get some more students involved, and students gave me input, and they would definitely like to see the, the lunch menu uh, for the 
next day. So thank you students for that feedback. I appreciate it and I'd love uh, for the month of March to really get some more students involved in announcements. Um, I'd love even for some students that want to share and contribute um, you know different types of uh, videos and kindness and uh, different types of expectations in our building. Um, I'd love to see some more students involved in our school. At this time let's hear some Lombard shout outs. We definitely have some shout outs today. The first shout out is from Kira. Wanted to give a shout out to Liberty Garrett and Justice Garrett for being such great friends. Nick Bauer wanted to give a shout out to Mrs. Rogers uh, for being, again, uh, such a nice teacher and so much energy. Mason Abbott wanted to give a shout out to Mr. Kano for being such a great band teacher. Uh, he just really enjoys band. Kelly Calkins wanted to give a shout out to Addison McCurry for being such a great friend. Sue Bailey, another shout out for Izzy Kennedy for being a great friend and she's so nice and supportive. And Anna London for uh, Grace Banks uh, for again always being helpful and helping her through tough times. I want to give Mallory Douglas a huge shout out uh, for truly helping a student get through a day. Um, and so I was so impressed with just her kindness and I hope that um, we can have more and more kindness being shared uh, like I got to witness with uh, Mallory. So great job to our students and I hope we can continue to celebrate more um, incredible things happening at Lombard Middle School. Let's quickly review our behavior expectation. I can follow the rules, I can follow the rules, and we'll have a good day when we follow the rules. Again, I want to make sure all of you have time today to celebrate within your homeroom. So again, I'll be short. Uh, we're going to keep this expectation going into next week as well. So again, just being on time, uh, I would love for our staff to just find some ways to really reward those students um, who are obviously in class on time. Um, and so make sure we are celebrating students who understand the importance of being on time and being ready to learn. I hope everyone has a fantastic Friday. Uh, I know it's it's been a tough week for me, so I always like to end on a positive. So I'll be so excited and thrilled uh, to see, again, incredible things happening in the classroom and in all areas of our building. I hope everybody has an absolutely fantastic Friday. I'd like to close out announcements with a message from Dean Ferguson. Good morning, Lombard. I hope that you guys are having an awesome Friday and have had a great week. I just wanted to let you guys know um, today's going to be my last day in the building for a little while. I have some things outside of school that I'm going to be taking care of. So I'll be gone for a few weeks. But while I'm gone, Mr. Magruder and Ms. Cano and Mrs. Hutton and Ms. Bredemeyer will be taking good care of you. If you need anything, feel free to reach out to them. Otherwise, I look forward to seeing you when I get back. Today is a new day. A day I promise to work hard, be kind, so proud, and celebrate life. We are.